Following contains sexual content and language. Viewer discretion is advised. We're back with Madison Young, producer, director, and host of the new series, Submission Possible, uncovering sex positive travel. Take a look. After 20 years of exploring the depths of BDSM, I knew what my mission was. I would discover what made each city's sex culture unique. I would paint a whole rainbow of 50 shades of feminist pleasure. Madison, love it. And people are calling you the Anthony Bourdain of sex travel. Tell me, what does that mean to you when you're being compared to Anthony Bourdain uh, in this new uh, journey of yours? You know, I absolutely love that. And I, I take it as the highest possible compliment because I loved Anthony Bourdain as well. And he used food as a language to really explore these different cultures. And I'm doing that same thing within the sex positive community of traveling to these different cities and connecting really with the people sex and kink it's just the language in which we're speaking but we're really getting more of an emotional deep dive and in, into the nuances of these folks lives what did you learn about sex positive seattle <laughs> so in seattle we really dove into the burlesque scene there which was very exciting and I got to learn so much about the history and the queer history of burlesque and its origins um, and its intersections with performance art. Now, in San Francisco, you explored what you call eco-sexuality. So what's that? So eco-sexuality, it's, um, you know, I think so many of us are ecosexuals without even knowing it. Ecosexuality is really about our connection to the earth and to the universe and the cosmos. Um, a tree has energy, the soil has energy, um, you know, the stars, the moon, the sun, right? Like when the sun goes away, like in the winter, we start to feel down, right? So we, we feed off of the energy of all these different natural elements. Ecosexuality is about connecting to those aspects of nature and developing a full relationship to the earth and the universe. And if we have this kind of relationship with the earth of thinking about the earth as a lover instead of say mother earth, um, the idea is that we would treat the earth better, that we would want to cultivate a healthier, loving, intimate relationship in which we're really taking care of the earth. Well, ecosexuality makes sense to me. I mean, think about it, either listening to gentle surf or listening to the rain or listening to, to a fire going. I mean, those are all physical things that can, you know, trigger that, that sensual button in you and uh, potentially in your partner. Absolutely. Well, thank you for sharing your special sensual travels with us. And Madison's new series, Submission Possible, is streaming now on Reverie.tv.